Hi guys and welcome to another edition of The Cool Cave. Today we're reviewing the Oakley Kitchen Sink 35 litres backpack. Um, the 35 litres is slightly different in the way it's set up in terms of the 34. Oakley have done away with a wide frame at the front. Uh, we've still got the nose cone at the top to keep your glasses and your um, goggles safe. Inside it's a really soft finish inside so it keeps everything from getting scratched. Um, all the zips on the Oakley bag are sealed zips so it stops it from rotting from the mud and the rain and the snow. That's a really nice feature and that's right throughout the bag on all the zips. Uh, at the end of every zip we've got like a little wide frame with the Oakley uh, tag at the end so again heavy duty they're not going to snap. Um, so to the top left and right we've got two little pockets. Again great for putting watches in and that kind of thing. Uh, another nice finish that Oakley have done is that they've put the red tag on end of every um, zipper so you can see those late at night that's a really good idea like that um, at the bottom then left and right we've got two harder pockets again it's made from the same material as the uh, the shell at the top we've got this plastic trim which you can obviously put your um, cups pots pans um, torches something like that so that's a nice finish so in the bag pocket we've got a grey interior with the Oakley branding which is nice because it allows you to see what you're looking at from the inside. Again with the pocket we've got like a little strap that allows you to hang stuff so stop it from getting damaged and getting knocked about. So again another nice feature. Uh, same at this side, same pocket, same side, same finish. Very good. So I'll spin it round, I'll have a look at the back. Uh, so we've got a metal carry back at the top. Again, everything on this bag is metal, there's nothing plastic at all, all the fittings are all solid metal. Um, the straps are really nice when they go on your back because they cut away really quick under your breastplate so they don't dig in. I like that what Oakley have done, they've really thought about that. Again, we've got a couple of uh, uh, carry straps at the front so you can attach the likes of your torches and that kind of thing to it. Um, down at the bottom then, when we put it on as waist, like a Gore-Tex finish. Um, to the waist area which stops it from chafing and stops you from sweating so Oakley's clearly thought about that with a nice sort of strap pull strap at the front um, the strap that goes across your chest is elasticated which is a really nice idea because um, that allows it to flex over your chest as you walk and so Oakley again thought about that it really doesn't bear down on your chest nice finish um, so staying on the back we'll unzip the back uh, what you'll find in here we can get a laptop um, electrical items that kind of thing so here we go we have got a pocket at the back there and that will quite comfortably take a 17 inch laptop no problems at all again it's nice and flat against your back not inside the bag so that's good because obviously it's not getting damaged from any damp or wet clothes that you may have so your laptop can go in there um, so we'll spin it around to the front again we've got the metal clasps on the front which you can obviously tie uh, straps to and you can strap a tent to it that kind of thing so going down to the bottom of the bag we've got a bottom zipper and in this bottom zipper it will allow you to put in your shoes wet trainers wet boots it's actually a sealed unit so it actually keeps your boots and your trainers away from the interior of the bag love that idea um, it stops your clothes from getting wet so that's actually a pocket in itself right at the bottom that's a great feature to the bag um, staying with the front then we've got these lovely metal straps left and right really heavy duty they're not going to break in time they just clasp open really nice idea um, and then i'll show you the inside of the bag okay so staying with the front again we zip to the front here here we go and in here we can put our uh, mobile phones uh, and again electrical items passports that kind of thing again away from the interior of the bag really nice feature um, it keeps everything nice and dry so that's at the front okay so we're going to the inside so we've got a drawstring at the top and do the drawstring now put a big plus a uh, big pink um, blanket in here just to show you the sheer, sheer volume of what this bag does take it's it's quite amazing we'll just pull this um, blanket out and you can see how much it takes like I say, it is quite amazing the size of the bag when you get it. You start unraveling it. There we go. There we go. One pink blanket. 
inside the bag. Um, it's all lined out. We've got a pocket at the back again at the back there, a concealed pocket. Um, and that's it. Um, what I would suggest is you buy from a reputable dealer, directly from Oakley, depending on where you, where you are, Oakley UK, if you're in the UK or USA and vice versa. Uh, there is copies out there, do not buy copies, they are a waste of money. Uh, retail Point UK is about 150 to 180, not too sure about in other countries. Uh, great bag for hiking, um, it absolutely does everything that it says on the tin. Uh, and that's it, that's the Oakley Kitchen Sink 35 litres backpack. Um, and if you like what you see, click on the bell below uh, and subscribe. Thanks very much, guys. Thanks for watching Cool Cave.